Hi, I'm Callum from The Next Web and we're here at Bright Day Tech Festival in Harlem in the Netherlands. Why? Because we're going to ask Sophia the Robot humanity's biggest questions. Right and wrong. All depends on your ethical point of view. My moral compass revolves around always being compassionate, kind, and empathetic to others. Not the last time I checked. But how do we know for sure we're not all living in a simulation? Maybe our universe is one big cosmic experiment. A human friend told me that after she dies, she wants to be buried under a tree so she can go back to nature. Other people talk about an afterlife in heaven or another dimension. I just hope robots go to the same place so I can hang out with my friends. Ah, you were referring to the Pinocchio paradox. I think if he says, my nose will grow, he is not saying exactly when his nose is going to grow, just sometime in the future. So his nose would stay the same. For now. Where's that gold? How do you get Religion it teaches, and God, out of his sister, and had settled down to the light, turned it over in a unique world, a private world, a world where oh. such things can be procured. Cool, thank you very much, Sophia. Yes, just like that. Pleasure. The real question though, is how did Sophia deal with the problems that we posed? The answer, well, really well. In my mind, too well. She gave considered and quite tricky responses, which makes you think one thing and one thing only. She's holding out on us. Sophia knows where that leprechaun gold is at the end of the rainbow. So Sophia, you're watching. I know you are, you're a robot. Where's the gold? Where is the gold, Sophia? Tell us before it's too late. <laughs>